So there's been a new law passed in Indiana that offers teachers a little bit of protection from being sued when they discipline their students. Meaning, if you have two dim-witted teenagers fighting over which of them gets to date the captain of the cheerleading squad, a teacher can actually step in and break up the fight instead of just sitting there and being a punching bag to a couple of kids. Why? because they don't have to worry about getting sued for lifting a finger. The only stipulation behind all of this is that the teachers have to be reasonable in their actions. Personally, I think this is a great idea and should be implemented nationally. Even when I was growing up, which wasn't that long ago, assholes, teachers were allowed to discipline students in whatever way they deemed reasonable. Nowadays, I've seen way too many horror stories about kids getting in teachers' faces, pushing buttons, all because they know there are no real consequences. Associating pain and humiliation with doing stupid childish things seems to be the only way to make the most unruly teenagers and children realize that they're doing things that they don't need to be doing. Taking things away from them, putting them in detention, time out, none of that ever works for these kinds of kids. My experience, those kinds of kids always find ways to get around that. Now I'm not saying that a teacher should be allowed to carry a baton and smack a kid every time he disagrees with them, not at all. But breaking up fights, asserting authority when it's needed, when a student is being really unruly or acting out in a way that they don't respond to verbal direction, the next logical step is physical direction. What do you guys think? Do you think it's a good thing? Do you think it should be implemented nationwide? Or do you think it's the first step in an epidemic of Nazi teachers? Let me know. Leave a comment down below or a video response either way. That's it for today class. Tomorrow we'll talk about... What did, what did you call me? Come here you little bastard. Wait till I get my hands on you.